Ahoy hoy chance. I've been watching you through people like N-Word Boy, Smokey McSee, and the UIS for a little over a year now. The things you've been saying lately are much more out of touch with reality than normal. As a duly appointed representative of the real world, listen to these indisputable facts. First, the vast majority of people who know you also know you are sicko. Anyone who has seen the exchange you had with Kate has no doubt about it. Lie all you want. A normal person would have, at the very least, asked some questions when the girl they're texting with said she was going to be 15. Especially if that person had been told a different age earlier, as you bogusly claim you had been. My response to, By the way, I will be 15 in May, I'm not too young at all. Would be more along the lines of, Wait, didn't you tell me you were going to be 18 when we talked on the phone earlier? You said your penis was all hers. Sicko thing to say, but coming from a sicko, it sounds about right. Fact, you, Chance Cyrax Wilkins, are a sicko. Second, it is quite obvious that you are not very smart. One could fill a multi-hour video of you saying and or doing dumb things. I am not pointing this out as an attack. It's a simple fact that your intelligence has been severely nerfed by genetics. And, because of that, you are not equipped to be engaging in battles of wit with fully brained humans. Let's face it, your go-to techniques in a debate are yelling and pulling your putt out. Those are not the marks of an intelligent person, Cyrax. In fact, the pud yanking only goes as more proof of the first truth. You are a sicko. Third, you are attracting more trolls every time you go online or post a video. For the year I've been watching, this community has only grown. Despite what you tell yourself, we're not attracted by money or clout. In fact, my videos about you are all posted under a Creative Commons license. We're here to keep you real chance, with facts and receipts. We're not living in the basement or attic. We have or are retired from jobs. We drive cars, make art, create music, and support each other. You need to understand, we don't think what we think because someone told us to. Your actions and words form our opinions of you. Attacking Kiwi tapes will most certainly increase the attention you get, especially because he only mentioned you in passing. People like Kiwi tapes. People loathe posers like yourself. Fourth, you are indeed a poser. Whether you're pretending to be an eraser, musician, audio engineer, or singer, it's painfully obvious you're none of those things. Sally might believe you are, but then again, how much time has she really spent watching you race? Or intentionally listening to your garbage? The best thing that can honestly be said about you is that you're a highly functional, highly regarded person. You can kind of, sort of use technology, but you can't do it well. Anything remotely cool you post is stolen. I made the graphics on my channel page. You stole a wallpaper and put your name on it. That's what posers do, Cyrax. I am just going to level with you, Chance. The situation you are in is remarkably simple, and it's not completely your fault either. You need to understand something incredibly important about being human. Life is pain. Anyone who says differently is selling something. That movie quote sums up the human experience better than almost any other. You grew up being sold on the lie that you could be anything you want to be. The truth is that you, Chance Wilkins, literally cannot be anything you say you want to be.